Hey guys, today we are going to browse the Defont website. So this is a very popular font website for crafters to download free fonts for their craft projects. This is the main page and they always have their recently added fonts here. You can also come up here to the top where they have everything categorized um, for you. So these are the fancy fonts, foreign, techno, gothic, basic, script, and dingbats, and holiday. What I like to do when I'm browsing for a new font on Defont, most of the time I'm looking for a basic font or a script font. Let's click on handwritten under script. This is a category that I personally look through a lot. Now what I like to do, if you see on the right hand side, you can see how many times this font has been downloaded, comments on the font, and then right here, this is the most important part, you can see this is free for personal use. So personal use would be you can use this font only if you're using it for yourself. If you're making a craft project, um, a digital design that you're going to sell, any type of item that you're going to profit off of, you need to purchase a commercial use license for. Excuse me. So let's click on Mango Salsa, and it says free for personal use. Most of these fonts that say that are going to have this warning on here. And let's see, she has, um, she accepts donations. And then right here, if you want to sell something with this font, she has links to how you can get the commercial license for this font right here. So you would just need to click on one of these and then purchase the font. A lot of times if you download a personal use font on um, Defont, you don't always get the full font. Um, like seeing these alternates here, a lot of times they don't include those on Defont. I see a lot of people who download these and then they expect to get the full font and they wonder where these alternates are and it's because they're not on there. So keep that in mind. I personally do not like to have any fonts on my computer that I have not purchased a commercial license for or it came free with a commercial license just because I don't want to get confused and accidentally use a font that I shouldn't. So what I do is right here um, where you can search, I always click on more options and then I always click on 100% free. And now we're going to submit. This means these are fonts that you can use for personal use and commercial use. Now let's click on Luna. This is a super popular craft font. And this is 100% free to use, remember. So you can download this and you can sell any item you make with this font legally. So here's this font, like I said, super popular. Let's go back. So any of these, 100% free. Let's look at some other categories. Let's go to calligraphy. And these are showing up from the most popular to the most downloaded. So I hope this helps you when you are looking for new fonts. I highly recommend if you sell any kind of craft um, and you're downloading fonts, I highly, highly recommend that you only do 100% free fonts from Defont or purchase commercial license so that you don't get confused later on. It's very important to support these designers so that they keep 
making awesome fonts for us. Please let me know if you have any questions about this. Leave a comment below what your favorite 100% free font is on the font if you want. I'd be really interested to see what yours is and I will see you guys next time. Bye.